Hello, this is Brad Wardell, the product manager of Starlock Tiles, a new program that allows you to organize your Windows desktop life. I'm going to do a quick ad hoc demo here to show you how Tiles works and why you might want to use it. So here I am, uh, this is Tiles on the right side here, and at, all, at first glance it looks just like a uh, Windows sidebar type thing, and it's completely blank because there's nothing on that. Tiles is organized by pages. This is a page, just demo start, and uh, there's I have here a really maxed out uh, tiles experience. So when I switch pages, so I'm going to go to my Elemental Coding page. Here I have, and I have uh, three different virtual desktops here. I mean, three different real desktops, I should say, three monitors. And so on different monitors, I have different things. So on this one, I have my code. And here I can switch between a database of interesting things that might be wrong with uh, users, negative traits, and uh, CVS shows up here. And the nice thing is, is that if I just click on it, I can instantly go back and forth and I can focus on just the things on this page. And that's really what Tiles is all about. You notice I didn't try, I'm not trying to get rid of my tar start bar here. Here my taskbar is full of junk and then my start menu is full of stuff. The point of tiles though is to make it so that you can really focus on what you're trying to get done at a particular time. So right now when I'm working on Elemental, this is these are the things I'm working with here. And then when I go over to say gaming, I have my various gaming things, Battlefield and um, Skyrim and you know, I got links to GameStop, Impulse, Steam, Origin and that kind of thing. Come over here to office work and I have just links to various things I'm working on on my various monitors and then uh, if I really want to surf the web here's I have uh, Fire, I, let's say I don't even have Firefox running I don't think right now on here but uh, sub pages can show up as mini tiles here and I can instantly switch to any which any one and it lets me like I said it's almost like using your desktop as a tablet except with all the benefits of still using a keyboard and mouse here's uh, my surfing th thing where I just want to mess around with uh, <laughs> with uh, Facebook my business plan is our uh, desktop. This is our the basement of our building we're working out. And there's just a whole bunch of different documents here that let me I can zip through here. And then here's my demo start, which uh, brings me back to a nice clean desktop. There are a ton of different ways to customize the way tiles look. So you can get the look pretty much however you want it to look. Like one of the things I like to do is I, I use window blinds so I can skin it to look uh, however window blinds already look so I, if I load that up here and in fact uh, you can add more things to tiles just by holding down a shift key and dragging things on here and now the window blinds uh, tile is there so I can go back to that at any time but uh, I can come over here in the window blinds and change the color so like arrow I'll make it pink and of course uh, that looks really horrible doesn't it uh, let me go to Turn off the color so it goes back to its native color. Go to Arrow Clay, let's say. And tiles will automatically pick that up. Or you can go on to Win Customize and download tiles specific skins if you have the third party skin feature. But the po point being is that you can uh, use tiles to, you can customize the way it looks completely. Now, if you don't like the way tiles looks, you can come over here and change the add different skins to it. Uh, you can uh, come over here and change the size. So you go, oh, well, I really don't like how big it is on this desktop. You can make it tiny uh, or make it small, medium, large, extra large, and so forth. Uh, appearance, there's just tons and tons of different options there. And uh, again, other ways in terms of uh, making it work the way you want to. Like, for example, for me, I like to have it work where when I change pages, it automatically minimizes and restores the programs that are on that page. So, uh, but you don't have to use it that way. If I want, I could use hide the taskbar entirely, but I'm not really trying to replace the taskbar with tiles. I'm just trying to get it to let me focus on what I'm trying to do because I have so much junk now on my computer that just like when we release fences and we we're trying to help people organize all the junk that's on their desktop to have a cleaner desktop, tiles is basically the same thing but for 
uh, users who are trying to do that with their their desktop, you know, their tasks, the things they're working on on their computer. It really helps them focus.